I never look at weight as a goal. Your weight doesn't matter for my goal. What matters for your goal is your health. I need to gain weight. Will this protocol help me gain weight? So this is another version of a lot of the questions that I get around people being afraid of weight loss or afraid of being slim. So I want you to think about what is your actual health goal. So is it that your health is fantastic, but you just want a rounder booty? You want some good portobello mushrooms on your shoulders? You know, you want to get a good bicep going? Like, what is that your only goal? Is you want to gain muscle mass so you can look like a bikini competitor, like ripped, right? Um, or is your goal that you need to improve something going on with your health? Or is it that you're focused on a number on a scale and you think somehow there's a perfect number for you and when you get to that number, everything's going to be okay? Most of the time when people ask me that question, they still have a lot of health problems and they're focused on the number and the scale. Your weight is not in and of itself very important. Uh, what weight you are gaining and what weight you have lost, that is way more important. And, and it's usually not your fault. Oftentimes doctors will look at that number and go, oh, this number is too low, gain weight. And then what will they give you? Sugary processed junk so that you can get fatter and then that number in the scale looks better and now you're sicker than you ever were before. It's preposterous, right? So I want you to get super, super logical about what your goal is. If you've actually solved all your health issues, you've done my protocol, your health is gorgeous, and you want to put on weight, then make sure you are leaning towards gaining muscle mass, not getting fatter, right? When you get fatter, you get sicker. How do you gain muscle mass? Well, you have to do intense bodybuilding exercise that actually strains and stresses those muscles so that they need to fix themselves, you get that soreness, and you gain strength. Once you've already gotten to the health you want, you can switch into a bodybuilding protocol. You can get stronger while I'm like goodbye lupus protocol. You won't gain weight, but you will gain tone, definition, you'll look ripped, you'll get abs, it'll be awesome, but you won't be any larger, okay? Once you're healthy, you could really, the best program would be to use my husband's Miracle Metabolism program. It's in his book, Miracle Metabolism. In that book, he shows you how to go from more of a fat loss, goodbye lupus protocol to a muscle building program where you can safely put on muscle. But realize that a bodybuilding diet, a diet that causes you to weight, gain weight, that you're gonna hopefully cause to be more muscle than fat, that diet has to be inflammatory. There is inflammation necessary in the weight gain process. And even when you're gaining muscle, if you're doing the exercise correctly, you'll gain more muscle than fat, but you'll still gain some fat. If you're not doing the right exercise, you're going to primarily gain fat, but there is some inflammation to eating for weight gain, not to muscle building. People confuse this all the time. They'll say, I heard lifting weights is inflammatory. No, lifting weights is fabulous. But eating in order to gain weight has some inflammation involved. You can minimize the inflammation on his program, but still it's required, which is why we always tell people, do not focus on the weight gain until your health is where you need it to be, okay? So hopefully that helps you. I never look at weight as a measurement, uh, as a goal. Your weight doesn't matter for my goal. What matters for your goal is your health. <laughs>